Hi folks, welcome back. Today we want to share one of our favorite toys, the Tesla coil. Like our laser harp, these are too complicated to do an in-depth review on, but we will explain a little about how they work. Please don't try build one of these on your own at home unless you really know what you're doing. These things are very dangerous and can kill you. So let's take a quick look at what makes the Tesla coil work um, and see it in action. The Tesla coil is a high frequency air core transformer that amplifies the input voltage using resonant voltage rise. What does that mean? Well, basically it's the electrical equivalent of pushing a kid on a swing and making them go higher and higher by pushing them at just the right time. Let's take a quick look at how this works. Uh, we run it off 120 volts AC, which we rectify up to 350 volts DC to power the entire coil. Um, this drives a primary circuit of a capacitor and a coil, uh, which oscillates at about 75 kilohertz or 75,000 times a second, causing about 700 amps of current to flow through this copper coil. Um, for comparison, it only takes a, a few thousandths of an amp to stop a human heart. All of this is achieved with a complicated little driver circuit that controls this massive and expensive transistor to turn the current on and off at precise times. The oscillating current uh, in this primary coil causes massive magnetic fields that are coupled with the secondary coil, uh, which is electro electrically tuned to the primary circuit. This causes a massive voltage to develop at the top of the coil here, where we have this toroid to build up the charge that will then discharge in the air because the voltage is so high. Well, that's enough talking. Let's fire it up and show you what it does. Now that may be cool, but one of the neat things we can do with this coil is interrupt the power and pulse the coil on and off very quickly. This creates sparks that fire at whatever frequency we want. So turning it on and off at 98 times a second, it sounds like this. Which is a G note. Turning it on and off at 262 times a second, we can play a middle C. But how do we get it to play more notes? Well, by connecting an interrupter to the driver circuit via fiber optic cable, we can connect various MIDI output devices to drive our coil. Let's try it with the keyboard. Better still, we can connect it to a laptop with some MIDI software and play whatever tunes we like. How about Yellow Rose of Texas? How can we make this better? I know, by having two of them. This is the twin coil and they love playing together. Now we can feed multiple MIDI tracks into two coils. Let's see what that looks like.
So there you have it, our twin Tesla coils. You'll probably see us using these a lot more in the future. In the meantime, check out our other videos and thanks to all of you for subscribing. We'll see you next time.